Good afternoon, everybody. P. Moody. Um, today is Monday, and today's video is respect given but not returned. So, how many of you maybe you've experienced that no matter how much you um you give respect, but the people that you give respect to, or even strangers, they just somehow manage not to give it back to you and they want the respect, but they're not willing to give it to you also. I wanted to tell you all, don't be discouraged. I know that it's frustrating, it's annoying. You're like, well, why should I give respect to these people when they don't give it to me? Whomever it may be, it may be someone you know, maybe it's someone you don't know. And the reason for that, that you should is because Jesus says so. I know a lot of times it feels as though we're giving people what they want, but the Lord said to do everything onto him. He says to do it as onto the Lord. So when, whether it be forgiving someone, you're not doing it for that person. You're doing it because that's what God requires of us because he first forgave us. That's what the Lord requires because that's what his word says. So we have to be obedient if we call ourselves Christ followers, then we must adhere to what he says and not question well, why do we have to do it? Don't worry about those people. Vengeance is the Lord's. He will repay. And it's not for us to see that they get repaid with the vengeance because that's not the way God operates. That's not the way the, the Lord Jesus does. Um, he will do it in his way, in his timing, and when he sees fit. Um, but it is a requirement for us to give respect. And that's also the law of the prophets is to be treat people the way you want to be treated. Um, so if you want to give, you want to get respect, then give it. Maybe everybody won't give it to you, but there'll be a good handful of people that will give it to you. And just know that everything that you do according to the will of God, that it's not in vain. So I just wanted to give this message to whomever it is that maybe they're feeling just completely disrespected and they're like, I'm fed up. I'm tired. All I do is give and do the right thing. And I feel like I get nothing in return for it. Your reward is in heaven. It may not even be on this earth. Maybe you will see it on this earth. But it's a guarantee that as long as you're doing the will of God, and you're doing what Jesus says, there's definitely a reward for you waiting in heaven. And that's more plentiful and it's more abundant than anything that we could ever see on this earth. It's far greater when you have it in eternity with the Lord our God. So I just want to encourage you, don't give up. Don't turn hard-hearted and cold-hearted into a mean person. This world will try to make you because that's the way the enemy set it up. But you live for Christ Jesus. You live for the Lord our God who is the Alpha and the Omega. So you walk in that and you be proud of that because your Father up in heaven rewards you when you do the right thing. I hope that this encourages somebody. I hope that it strengthens you. And when you don't have strength, just lean on the Lord who will strengthen you. He is a present help in the time of trouble. God bless you all. P. Moody. Have a great day.